Hello everyone. So in the last video we did the multiple fully connected layer step. And we got this result. Today we will look at the final layer of the transformer encoder, which is the normalization. Okay. So I divide this into two. Right. Uh, the output of the fully connected layers was this zero point three zero point three minus zero point four. Sorry, this is zero point three. The uh, layer, the normalization, uh, the or uh, or layer normalization is a bit different from batch normalization as I explained in a previous video. Uh, we will look at the difference with uh, batch normalization in the example. So it uses this formula, x minus expected value of x divided by the square root of the variance of x plus epsilon multiplied by some parameters which you can just ignore for this video epsilon we just make it zero for simplicity okay so the dimension let's this is the x the dimension of x as always is is by e input time input size by e embedding dimension is e uh, which is three by two right so let's start by computing the expected value of the mean. I have already calculated it and it is 0 0.1 minus 0 0.1 minus 0 0.1. How did I calculate minus the first minus 0 0.1? Well, uh, it is 0 0.3 minus 0 0.4 plus minus 0 0.4 which is minus 0 0.4 divided by 2 so unlike in batch normalization where the mean is calculated across e this is a calculator across is across each kind of across each training example and the output of the uh, expected value has a dimension of is by 1 let's compute the variance of x the formula for variance is this divided by e. So typically in batch normalization, in typical, in typical variance formula, you, you divide by is or say n number of examples, but here you divide by the embedding dimension. And the variance, I've already calculated it. It is 0 0.18, 0 0.18. How did I calculate the first 0 0.18? Well, it is 0 0.3 minus, minus 0 0.1, right, the, the mean, squared plus minus 0 0.4 minus, minus 0 0.3 one squared then you add them you add this term and this term then you divide by e which is two that's how i computed 0 0.18 we also need to compute the square root of the variance which is 0 0.4 0 0.4 and 0 0.4 i've already done it by the way there might be some mistakes in the calculations and uh, its dimension is is by 1. So we have the expected value, we have the variance, we just need to plug it into the into the final formula. And after plugging it in, I got this result. 1, 1, 1, minus 1, minus 1, minus 1. Uh, the input of the layer normalization dimension is the same as the output layer normalization the output of the layer normalization dimension which is is by e 
So this is the output of the layer normalization on the normalization as I wrote and this is the output of the transformer encoder and this is it. Uh, thank you very much.